Yo, 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 what is going on, what is going on, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Tom Origins here with my potato hair, look at that fringe, it needs cutting, it's getting cut on Thursday, but that's later on. Pretty much, things I've got to talk about, it's the, ten, it's the 10th, no it's not, it's the 11th, no it's not, it's the 12th, there we go, it's the 12th of December, uh, the time you're going to be watching this video, and it's going up, but what happens is it's actually the 11th, and it's like 11 o'clock at night on the 11th of December, so that's pretty cool, but PlayerUnknown's Battleground, which is a game that was on PlayStation, uh, not PlayStation, Keep saying PlayStation. PS, it was on. <laughs> I can't keep saying it. PC. Player Unknown's Battleground was a game that was on the PC for a long time. And I really was thinking about getting a PC just in order to play that and a game called DayZ as well. But Player Unknown's is coming to Xbox 5 o'clock tomorrow morning. DayZ is coming next year. So no need to get a PC. Really happy. So I'm going to wake up with setting an alarm. You film that. I've seen, I've, you know, I'll show a clip of me with my alarm setting it. Set an alarm. Ready to wake up at 5 a.m. to buy the game, to download it, have it download. But this is the conundrum, ladies and gentlemen. Tomorrow, my timetable, I have three hours in the morning where I do nothing in school. I don't have to be in. Because there's an assembly thing that a lot of kids have to go to. But because where I live where I live, uh, and my timetable's the way it is, my teachers said, obviously, you don't have to come in. But... I don't come in for the assembly. I'm gonna let this. I'm gonna let the spoilers drop. I don't come in for assembly. I don't come in for an amazing bacon sandwich that everyone seems to be having. Sausage and bacon sandwiches. Nah, no, I've seen them. I've smelt them. They're pretty nice, but I don't come in for them. I don't come in for the assembly. Cringe. In three, two, one. I come in to see Helen. I like seeing her. She's my girlfriend. I've not had a nice girlfriend before. I don't even have. A, I've never had a proper girlfriend before, but this is a proper one because it's been a few months now and it's getting serious. So I'm liking it. I'm really liking it. I'm loving it. And it's a bit weird that people can't just grow up and move on about that. Because I'm not being horrible. End of the day, a relationship is normal. There's millions of them, you know? Don't boggle at mine. Boggle at someone else's. Because, I don't know. I'm not going to get coped up into that anyway. Because it's, it's, it's good at the minute. So I want it to stay good and keep getting better. But pretty much, uh, I go in to see her like I do every morning. So I'm going in. I'm not... I'm, I could have... Uh, you know, if I wanted to, be horrible, I could have gone, woke up at five, downloaded me game, gone back to bed, stayed in bed for a few, come into school at, at like period four, have me two lessons and go home. But I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that because I like seeing Ellen. She doesn't ask me to, you know, if it was up to her, she'd have me stay at home. She'd say, you know, if it's up to you, you know, it's up to your choice. She's like that. She's not like demanding. She's not horrible. She's not overpowering. She's really nice. And that's why I, I, I do what I do for her. Second thing, big Amazon box behind me. My mum's presents come, my mum's Christmas presents. So I'm going to wrap that now, and uh, I've got that for her, so she's going to love that. Also, on Wednesday, Christmas jumper day, so I've got to wear a Christmas jumper in sixth form. Then, staying behind uh, with with Helen, going back to us for a bit of lunch. Then coming back with her, doing some rehearsals for this play that me and her are in next year. And then, after that, I'm going to go back, have some tea at Helen's, then get picked up, then go watch Alan Carr live. What? I love Alan Carr, not Alan Carr. Shit, said the wrong name, wrong comedian. Jimmy Carr, Jimmy Carr, we all love Jimmy Carr, don't we? I like Alan Carr too, but he's but he's pretty funny. I like him, but I like both of them, they're not related. But Alan Carr and Jimmy Carr, Alan's the talk show host, Jimmy's a comedian, bit, uh, bit tongue and cheek comedian there. So I'm watching him with my mum and my dad tomorrow in Oldham, so I'm very excited about that. And uh, I can't wait to watch him. I think he's going to be really funny and really great. So that's going to be on Wednesday. Thursday, I'm getting this trim, look at this hair, look at this hair, look at this fringe, this fringe is back again. I'm gonna get this fringe cut off me because it's just it's just getting in my eyes. It, it just keeps getting in my eyes, everyone. It does me head in. But getting that exiled from my head, gonna get the sides done, looking real nice and tidy for Christmas. But just before Christmas, on the Saturday, I'm having me I'm having myself a nice little bit of a planner day, doing some things, sorting some bits and bobs out, and then Sunday, Sunday, your boy turns 17, and oh my. God, I can't believe it. Never been this excited for a birthday before. I'm very excited. Got got some things sorted out. Family and everything and friends and everything and Helen and everything. And I'm just dead excited. I've never been this excited and proper hype this year. Don't know why. I think I do know why. But I'm very excited and I can't wait. It's going to be awesome. So really good week. Really good weekend. Going to be 17. Oh my God. Next week, break up from school. But that's, and that's a new week. That's a new episode. That's a new series. I'll see you all at 5am after I show you the clip of me setting my clock for 5am see you in a minute yo 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 what is going on what is going on my ladies and gentlemen my name is Tom Origins and no I am not doing a snap oh god Jesus Christ 
There we go. Got my streaks going. I got Big Dick Daddy. I got Jonathan Chew. Shout out to all these Snapchat names. Go at them. Go at them. Add these people on Snapchat. Give them a shout out. Yeah, I see you there. I see you there, Liz Black. Uh, go on, everyone. everyone that's my streaks. I've, I've got zero streaks going on Snapchat, really. Here we go. We're going to go on to this section. I got my daily vlog. Where is it? Uploading. There it is. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add this alarm because we got to be ready to pound the alarm as PUBG comes out tomorrow, 12th of December. But the time you're watching this, it'll be the 12th of December. So what do we want? We want some... We want some serious music. We need some serious music. We're going to have the one from Rick and Morty. There we go. So we're going to have that. There we go. Have the volume on full. Five o'clock. What do we want to name this alarm? We want to name it... Pub G. Some... Some sad face, some laughing face, some serious face because that's what's going to be going down in that game. That's what's going to be going down in that game. So yeah, save that. There you go. Got six hours. Got six hours. Ain't going to sleep yet, however. I'll probably be going to sleep around about 11, maybe 12. Depends how excited I am. But uh, definitely going to have to get some sleep if I'm waking up at 5. Don't know if I'm going to wake up at 5 and install it. See how big the game is. See how long it's going to take to install Maybe try and squeeze a game out before going to school. Don't know if the servers will be up by then. Uh, but uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see what's going to go on. I've just got that alarm set for 5. Ready for me to hop up. Slam open. Slam open PUBG on the Xbox. And just see where we're at. Already. Already getting killed. I'm playing Fortnite at the same time right now. But already getting killed by some absolute viruses over on Fortnite. So I just need to get this game gone i need to get pubg i'm gonna end this part of the video hopefully you enjoyed this little phone screen recording thing that i used so yeah there's my alarm set i'm ready to leave and go and download pubg i'll speak to you then ladies and gentlemen it is oh god that is that is far away what the hell Ta -da, there it is it is 10 past five and i got up and i've got myself in my chair, and what is on the Xbox store next to Call of Duty? What do I see? I see player in the battleground. It's finally here. Dramatic zooms. Yes, there it is. Awesome. Right, so I'm gonna open this up. Player unknowns battlegrounds. Twenty-five or oh, twenty-four ninety-nine. So. Penny, a penny off. Xbox One X enhanced. Do you know what that means? That means it can be played on the Xbox One X, which is really cool because I've got a cheeky suspicion that's what we're gonna get for Christmas. But uh, but uh, but I uh, don't. But look at the screenshots. Like wow, 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 wow. Oh, lot of wow. Hold on a while. Hold on a while. All of this looks too good. It looks too good to be true. It looks so good. Look at the game clip. What? That's insane. It looks so good. It looks so real. Look at this guy. Look at it. Oh my god. No. We have to buy this. We have to buy this now. We have to get this now. Now. We're buying it. We, we're, we're buying it. I'm, I'm buying it. I bought it. I bought it. There you go. There it is. Downloading. Downloading. Oh my god, I can't wait for this. I, 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 just, I just can't wait. I, I just can't. Uh, let's see uh, if there's any updates that I need to do. Hopefully not. I don't think there is. So we're just gonna skip it. And we're gonna go to the top. And we're gonna look at where PUBG is. <gasps> Holy shit, it's smaller than Red Dead. What? 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 It is smaller than Red Dead. But bigger than Minecraft, which means that this game is going to install really quickly. 
Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go get a shower, like right now, and get myself ready for school, so I can, I can come back and play this. I'll give you an update right after the shower. Your boys just had a shower comes out to see that this is on 97%. Ooh, ooh, get to 98%. Go on, get there, get there. I have to dry my hair, I've got my uniform ready to get into. I'm gonna get my hair stuff out. But I realized that, yo, it's only gonna be 6 a.m. by the time I've finished my hair and downloaded this. So I'll be able to play this for a whole hour. I'll get an hour out of this before I have to go to school. So that's awesome. Can't wait. Get my hair stuff. Oh, natural hairspray. Got myself my hairbrush. Got myself my brush. Got myself my little my little thing to do my hair with. And this. And oh, of, of course, this. Simple. Very basic necessities. Minion calendar. We do love our minion calendar. Right, I'm trying to find where the number is. There it is. Found it. Go on. I've got no fingernails. I need to stop biting them off. Hel Helen tells me this, but and she never mentioned that I needed them to, to open advent calendars with. What is it? They're all different shapes. I've realised this. That one is a mitten. Which is funny because it doesn't taste like a mitten. Love it. Yo, so pretty much it's uh, 6.01 in the UK at the minute. I've downloaded Player in the background. I'm all ready to go to school. School shirt on. I never thought I'd be wearing a school shirt. 6 a.m. All showered, ready to go to school. Playing PUBG. Have a morning. So that's gonna be pretty cool. I like a bit harsh in this lighting, but I don't think I don't think I've done a pretty good, you know. I don't think I've done a bad job of getting ready this quick. I never have gotten ready this quick before. Player Unknown's Battleground is in game preview. It is PUBG for short. It's on 5.2 gigabytes, so it's just bigger than Minecraft at 1.2 gigabytes. Smaller than the compatible Red Dead Redemption from Xbox 360, which is 7.4 gigabytes. And we're gonna see that. Uh, what this game's gonna be like. So, I'm loading it up now and I'm switching over to the front camera. So, there we go, we got PUBG. Syncing data for PUBG? I currently don't have any data for PUBG. So let's go make some data for it. Okay. Here we go, PUBG. I've been waiting for this game so goddamn long. This TV is very loud. I'm gonna have it at 8 volume because 8 is the best. See what's happening. Video. There's gonna be a white screen with music over the top. What's Oh god, okay. They are known battleground. Look at that. Wow. Already some amazingness from just the loading screen. Oh my god, okay, options, English, yep, vibration, yep, dead zone, yep, sensitivity, I, I don't have a clue what to do with any of these, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna apply, okay.
There we go. Okay, that was a bit weird. I didn't know what the hell was happening then. This is gonna be so good. Male. I can make my character. Okay, I'm gonna be a male. Gonna have that face. Customization. I'm gonna. It's very bright on my TV at the minute. Let's try and turn that volume down like that. Appearance. What hair are we gonna go for? Okay. Ah, oh, I, I, I had to pause the game then because I was sneezing so much. Uh, I don't. I, I'm really confused on what the hell I'm going to be doing. Okay. I don't have any wardrobe, so that's what my character is going to look like. I just want to play, to be honest. I'm going to just play. I'm going to start. I'm going to see what happens. Right, so I just played my very first game of PUBG right at the end and got killed. But I've got to tell you for a fact, this game is shaping out to be really good. I know what you saw, like for a, a viewer who's not watched uh, any player unknown gameplay before. If you're brand new to this game, you're probably thinking, Tom, why are you interested in a game like this? It's 24 quid, you've just ran around a field, got a few guns, and then got killed at the end. What? what, what why do you like it? It's more of the thrill, really, because with other games, you kind of know who you're up against. You've got your very good players, you've got your very minimalistic players. But in a game like this, skill is really weird because I could be the worst player in the world, but if I find a fully automatic weapon before someone else does, I'm going to take them down um, if I get an angle on them. And it's a really strategical game mentally. You've got to really plan your strats. Like I was waiting under that doorstep for so long. That guy came upstairs, they were fighting. If I wouldn't have come down, like come out of my spot, I could have hid there longer. They would have killed each other, or maybe one of them would have got really hurt. I would have gone out and finished the last guy off. But I didn't do that, I was just too excited and tried to get some good footage. But I think that games like this are so good, and I think Fortnite did a really good job with it, the free version. But I think PUBG, which is this version, the official version that Fortnite kind of copied and kind of did their own cartoony spin-off of, I really think this game's going to be phenomenal, and I can't wait to play more of it. But for the first game, I'm not mad. I really liked the first game, really loved it. I'm getting into my second game now, and if anything interesting happens, I'll set my camera up ready to film it for you. So, yeah, I just, I can't wait. I'm going to go to school so hyped about this now. So, this happened, my second game I played. I recorded and game clipped myself with the, um, I think it was the MK14, like this little, uh, semi-automatic rifle sort of thing and it's going to look a bit weird on a game clip but hopefully the, the TV will fix that up a little bit for me but uh, I was running through a field with the uh, little rifle here that I had I watched this guy popping off shots as you can probably see him uh, over there just moving around and I witnessed him I was going to try and run up to him and play objectively sneaky like against him but then I didn't know where he was turning whether because of the blue outline because I was outside the shield at this point I didn't know whether he was facing me or facing away or facing someone and I came up right next to him, he didn't spot me, then he opened fire on me, I opened fire at him, we exchanged rounds and I clipped him in the head and got my very first kill in PUBG. So uh, here was another clip that I managed to record, it was um, 
me in a in this little yellow this li li like uh, little yellow car thing that I robbed, and someone started firing at me, so my health bar was like nil, and I managed to drive this car away for a really long time. And I ended up having to drive through the red zone, which is an area that gets selected to be like blown up and nuked by like a lot of like explosives. Like every now and again, the red zone will appear. And I got to do some really cool drifts in the car completely by accident. I'd never been in a car before. It was my very first time being in a car in PUBG. And all the explosions were going off. And I think in a minute you'll see it on this side. That, that massive explosion fireball right next to the car. And then I'm just driving and driving. And then sadly I got to a point over here and my game just crashed. And that was heartbreaking. But at least I got in my first car and I drove a car for the first time. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to load up PUBG and get another game in before I go to school. So I'm um, playing PUBG at the minute, I just found this boat from the air, like I parachuted in and found this boat, but this guy got in it first, but I wasn't letting him get away with it that easy, I hopped in next to him, I don't know if he knows I'm here, I don't care if he knows I'm here, but I'm, I'm, this guy is meant to be killing me, he's like an enemy, we're all enemies in this game, it's every man for themselves, and this guy is driving me around in this boat, so me and him are just chilling, we've become friends, I found a friend in PUBG. First world problems 101, one car won't start, so we've taken the other one, simple fix.